Hello guys and welcome to the 40th mod review and this is the Star Wars mod. Okay, let's go straight into our room. So, let's get rid of that. So, uh, yeah, this is the Star Wars mod. Um, it's really cool. I found it. I found it the other day. So, uh, yeah, let's go and uh, see what this has in store. So, I've laid out some chests. So, uh, this is crafting one. So, let's open it up. This is an instant holocron house. Um, that, when you place that in the crafting table, you will get uh, some of these which is the crystal piece to make a handle you need two iron ingots like so which will make the handle so that's uh, some handle uh, items which I can install is all these lightsabers uh, armor uh, blaster a laser gun, uh, instant hologon house, and the crystal piece. So there are some of the items. Next is crafting two. <coughs> to craft a blue lightsaber, you will need a handle, lapis lazuli, uh, instant hologon house to craft the blue lightsaber. To craft a, holog a hologon, you use nine pieces of crystal piece like so, which will craft you the hologon. Now, to craft the rebel laser gun, which I've tried, I think, and it doesn't work, I'm not sure, so let's try it in the crafting table. Uh, so, let's go to the crafting table, which I've placed just here. So, you do this, like so. Yeah, it doesn't work, but in the, um, on the actual forum post, it does tell you to craft it like that. Uh, yeah, that, that glitched out then. Um, told you to do that, so I don't know what's going off there. Well, yeah, that's how you make the uh, rebel laser gun. Then here's crafting three. Uh, if you place a hollow gun into the crafting table, you will get nine crystal pieces. To craft the instant hollow gun, uh, you use nine. Uh, no, wait, one, two, three. Eight uh, crystal pieces and place a hologram, holocron in the middle, like so, and you will cut the instant hologram house. So yeah, that's basically it about this mod. And it just adds in lightsabers uh, and new items and armor. Um, well, let's review a lightsaber. So here's the single lightsaber. So if you right click, it will close. What the fuck? No. What the hell? What the fuck? Don't know what happened there? There we go. So if you right click, um, it will close and then open again. Um, now it would be cool if you had sound. Um, when you right click where and it opens and closes like it does in the film and also when you swing it makes that noise uh, that um, what lightsabers make uh, here's the double one you can't actually see the other end unless you press F5 like that but really it doesn't look like a double lightsaber to be honest it, that end bit needs to be a bit longer um, shit, sorry about that, uh, you yeah, pressed to stop the cord. But yeah, like I was saying, it, that end bit needs to be longer, so that's about it, really. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, I just did a quick review on the uh, Star Wars mod. And uh, now at the beginning, when I um, did a long pause, that's where music will be, so yeah, it should work, I'm not too sure though.
But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this. I'll be right back on how to install this awesome mod. Hey guys, welcome back on how to install uh, the Star Wars mod. So let's go into our Minecraft game. Click options, force, force update, done. Login. While that is updating, you will get downloads from my description, which will take you to too many items, Minecraft Forge, and the Star Wars mod. So now go to your start button, type in percent at beta percent, click on your roaming folder, go into your dot Minecraft folder, go into your bin folder. Before you open up your Minecraft.jar file, you've got to make sure your Minecraft game is closed. But mine is still updating, like usual. <laughs> But yeah, now close your Minecraft game. Now open your Minecraft.jar file with Rinmar. If you haven't got Rinmar, link to the description. So open it up with Rinmar. Move that aside. <coughs> Before installing any mods, you have to delete meta imp. So delete meta imp. Click yes. Now open up Minecraft Forge. Move, uh, move that aside. Yes, there is a meta inf in there, but do not delete it. Click Ctrl A to highlight everything. Apart from the three dots, drag and drop into your Minecraft.jar file. Click OK. You are done with Minecraft Forge, so close that off. Now open up too many items. Move that aside. Scroll down. Highlight everything. Apart from the three dots, drag and drop into your Minecraft.jar file. Click OK. You are done with too many items on your minecraft.jar file, so exit off both them. Make sure you're still in here because you're going to go to your .minecraft folder. So go to your .minecraft folder. If you haven't made the mod folder, right click new folder, call it mods. Double click into your mods folder. Simply drag the Star Wars mod into your mods folder if you want to know if it's working properly. Click login. Just wait till everything loads properly. Um. Ah, oh, Minecraft has crashed. Um, I don't know why it has crashed. Uh, but it worked earlier perfectly fine, because as you will tell. But yeah, um. You just go into your mods folder on your Minecraft uh, game and just see if it's all there. Um, I'll see if I've done it right, actually. Um, you might have to put it into your dot, uh, into your bin, into your, uh, yeah. Yeah, I did it wrong, guys. Sorry about that. Um, you have to go into your bin folder, open up Minecraft uh, dot jar. With Rimmar. Then you go into here, click Ctrl A to highlight everything apart from the three dots, drag and drop into your Minecraft.jar file, click OK, exit off, everything, want to know if it's working, click login. Shut up dog. <laughs> uh, so there we go, it's working. You will say six mods loaded, go into your mods folder, check everything is there. Yep, everything is there. Uh, sorry I did it wrong the first time, um, but I hope you did it anyway, so uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, click that like button, um, subscribe to me on here, uh, and follow me on Twitter, also like my Facebook page, adios.